We're here with the winners of best British game for Forza. 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 Horizon 4. Guys, how are you doing? Uh, I think we're all thing. still in a little bit of shock, Chris. <laughs> are you? Yeah. Yeah. Did you not expect to win? Uh, well, we were in pretty amazing company right. with regards to nominations. Who was so, your biggest uh, competition, do you reckon, in that well, category? Well, I think, I think we all were talking about Red Dead yeah. 2 a lot but on the way here. overcooked, everyone yeah, was overcooked yeah, yeah. and everybody... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But to be fair, your game was, like, super British. Set in it's Britain. Set in Britain. <laughs> so, like, you obviously got extra bonus points for it being set in wow. Britain. Maybe if Red Dead had been in Somerset... How many yeah. cowboys done they have in Somerset? P perhaps. <laughs> yeah. It is Morgan. a happy coincidence, isn't it? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes. So, I mean, it is it's super... I mean, what was the kind of decision to come to Britain? Because, like, you don't... For me, I don't ultimately think, like, oh, hey... I mean, maybe it's because I live here and I get stuck on the M25 quite a lot, <laughs> but, like, it's not your first reaction in terms of, like, sexy coastal, you know, lanes. Mm. But the funny thing is, so Horizon Games have been uh, nominated for Best British Game, well, one, two and three, mm. uh, and, and, and didn't win. So we kind of thought, well, what, what can we do? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay, oh my god, that would be I'm amazing kidding. Machiavellian but, plot twist. I know, right? Well, <laughs> that doesn't work. How you, BAFTA? Um, uh, can you story. remember any of the answers? I, I can remember a couple of the answers. Yeah, great. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, so actually, you know, I, I remember the team coming to us and saying that they wanted to, they wanted to uh, place the game in our own back. Yeah. backyard so to speak and, um, and I think it's fair to say that we all uh, originally took a fair bit of convincing really? and I think through the process of creating it we all we we found a new appreciation for for this country uh, and it, it turned into a, a real passion project for everybody so did you have to go on like road trips and stuff because they, they, oh, they went into the details the that's what they did <laughs> with their rulers the ready it's inside the jacket right ready to go should there be an interesting <laughs> puddle coming along Is that a <laughs> i think you, you, it's like we've had this conversation before yeah. i know we yeah, have yeah. i can't i can't stop <laughs> so calling you puddle measurers but yeah but yeah did you go on some road trips did you like take some tours about we did Yes. Um, yeah, we kind of went all over. That, that was the beauty of it being in Britain. It was much easier to go out and take photos of things and measure things, as, as you say. We, we did like to measure things. Um, <laughs> and, see, and also have a blast while we were doing it as did well. Did you? Yeah, I mean, yeah. there are some great road trips to be had in this country. Though. Did you create some epic uh, playlists for your road trips as you went around? Did some, was, whose job was it? That's a good question. Who had the ox cord? Come yeah. On. yeah. Yeah, I, so not me because <laughs> that is true. I, I genuinely no. pick the most depressing yeah. music. <laughs> usually, it's Jeff Beck again. <laughs> <we'd say. laughs> exactly. Um, what would you say is because uh, obviously you know the season kind of played a huge part of it. Obviously, the the, the, the countryside, everything itself. What is the bit that you're most proud of? Is there a bit where you're in the game and you drive into an area and you're like, and you every time you see it, you're just like, no. Oh. I mean, there are for, so many for, to choose for me, from. it's Edinburgh. Yeah, um, of course. For me, it's Edinburgh because I used to work in Edinburgh, and I couldn't believe how we nailed that city in the game. Everyone loved it. The it's, feedback was it's huge. So cool. yeah. It's so it's great. It is a great city. Um, I don't, I don't I, know about I, you. I, well, I get an enormous amount of flack for this in the studio because I, I say it a lot. But the British moorland was like, Ooh. Yeah, yeah. purple heather. You don't, you don't oh, see it yeah. very often. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, normally you do on. drive through a fair bit of it. And, uh, well, and, and, and it does make for a great road trip as well. Amazing views. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, Amazing. well, look, we're going to let you get back to the party. Go have some more champagne. <laughs> Enjoy the evening. And uh, congratulations, congratulations again. Thank well you deserved. So Thank well you. done. Thank, Thank you. you.